Hey guys, this is Matthew Taylor for OutstandingPoker.com and today I'm bringing you part 2 of the Heads Up Sit and Go series that I'm doing. Um, this is about the 50th time I've tried to record it. The first couple of times I've had uh, a Camtasia error pop up halfway through the video and for the second half of the video there's been absolutely no volume at all. Um, so today what I'm going to do is I'm going to record um, I think one at a time and then pause it and then um, I'll render the video and then I'll put them all together at the end to make a more uh, complete video until I can get this Camtasia issue sorted. Um had a bit of um dilemma as to what to do for you for the second part, whether to go through another PowerPoint video with just a couple of live games at the end. And uh, I thought it'd just be best for this if I just went through and played a few heads up sit and goes and you watching me play live at um a few different levels I'm gonna play um, probably starting at the 11s and then work all the way up to the level that I'm currently playing at which is the 50s um, if you're following my blog on outstandingpoker.com my kind of video blog that I'm doing for this I uh, started off with $100 and I've managed to work it up to over, well over 2000 now in the space of 13 days of play um, just playing heads up sitting goes and I'm at the $55 level these 5750s um, doing quite well at them as well and making some decent profits. Um, part 3 of the video I'll record this week as well and that should be up soon too. Um, that's going to be more of a PowerPoint video again focusing on middle stages and late game as well. I know that Hockey Guy has been asking me a um, few, well not just Hockey Guy actually I've had a few people asking me for more information about the late game stuff that I've mentioned such as Sage and the Nash Equilibrium and I'll get to that in part 3 but for now I think uh, it would just be best if we concentrate a bit more on the early stages and the best way I think for you to do that um, at the minute is just to watch me play some some games as actually as they happen so I'm just going to fire up an 11 dollar one here, it's the level that I hate playing um, in the couple of times that I've recorded this before, the eleven dollars I've lost, but pretty much every other level I've won at. So, just waiting for someone to sit with us here. It usually doesn't take very long at the elevens for someone to sit down with you. Game selection isn't important or anything like that. So you just um, just sit in the first one that becomes available, and we've actually got a gold star sat with us. So this should be quite a tough match. It should be quite interesting. Um, stereotyping gold star players. Gold Star Plus usually have a good idea what they're doing. Um, three, three deuce. I'm not going to raise three deuce off suit, even though I do like to raise the first hand of every sit and go heads up sit and go that I play, just to um, make my intentions known and let them know that I'm going to be aggressive right from the very start. Uh, he limps his. Hey again guys, um, sorry about that, the volume cut out really early there so I'm going to see how long I can make it with this one. Um, not miss too much, I've just been missing every flop that I've been raising like this one. Um, my focus actually went a little bit as well whilst I was trying to sort